I'm Andrea Vasquez. I'm Jimencio, and this is OG Interviews. But you gotta do it with me, though. Te di todo mi amor y más Y tú No reconoces ni lo que es amar Hey, mi gente, I'm Moon, and this is OG Interviews. One of my guests refers to her original style of country music as country with a little tajin. She's a country music rising star releasing her first Spanish single, a very special duet with a multi-talented Latin recording artist who has worked with many artists, many groups, including Grupo Intocable. Andrea Vasquez, Jimencio, welcome and thank you for your time. I appreciate the opportunity. Let's talk music. Andrea, your current song is a duet with Jimencio. The song, Si Una Vez, a Selena original, wasn't a duet when Selena sang it. How did you decide on this particular song and why did you make it into a duet? First of all, we both love Selena for so many reasons. She paved the way for so many of us Latinos, especially in the Tejano space, the country space, just really in all the realms of music here. Um, but we played a show this past fall mm -hmm. for Hispanic Heritage Month. And um, we kind of just decided then to do a duet and that was gonna be Siona Ves. And we posted a video of us rehearsing it. We posted videos of us playing the show and just the responses we got on social media. Everybody's like, why don't you guys record it? And then after enough times, we're like, okay, yeah. let's record it. And then how do you, how do you make a Selena song your own without, you know, everybody being like, but it's a Selena song. You can't make it. We're like, let's make it country and kind of mesh our worlds together. So that's how we did that. Did you know each other before? Had you worked together at all before? Or how did you connect? We knew each other on like a small capacity. We didn't really like have, like we weren't friends, friends, if you would say, like we didn't really know each other to hang out every day. Um, but I connected with her when I moved to Nashville from San Antonio. And then we kind of just stayed in connection, just did yeah. our own thing. And then I remember she was doing a, um, a rooftop sounds mm -hmm. event. And then they had asked me to sing too. So I was like, oh, dope. But then she was like, dude, let's do Siona Ves. Let, you know, we kind of put something together. And I was like, oh, I mean, I'm nervous, but let's do it. You know, it's a Selena song, you know, so. But it came out really, really great. Was there any fear of possibly angering Selena fans with your version of Siona Ves? I feel like anytime you send an artist puts out a cover, you're always going to get the people being like, well, we like the original better. Or just whatever. So we've just... And yeah. Selena fans are diehard fans. Yeah. And I know, I mean, we know that for sure. So I think the idea of doing something different with the Selena song was okay. But, um, you know, with respect to the Queen and of course to, to Tejano music, and that's where I come from. So the idea was understanding my roots. And that's where that came from, where it was like, you know what, to me, it was kind of paying homage to the Queen of my roots and uh, in music. And so it just kind of felt fluid. It didn't feel like we were trying too hard. It didn't feel like it was something that we were kind of taking out of nowhere. It was just kind of, it felt, Kind organic of, yeah organic so it was easy for us to do that but there was a fear there and i mean you know and of course it's going to happen with any of you if a singer tries to do a whitney song mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's always going to be a thing you know but we took the risk and, and and did what we thought was um best in our own way to pay homage to selena andrea this is actually your first spanish single how does that feel for you I feel like, especially it being a Selena song of obviously I was pretty nervous going into it. I mean, I, Spanish was my first language um, and, you know, just being country, you know, you're just in this bubble where it's like, you have to be very country. You have to be this, you have, we put each other in little boxes. Mm -hmm. And more recently, everybody's like, why haven't you added any Spanish to your music? And you're like, well, for so long, it's been just a thing that you just don't really do. And now we are kind of embracing that, which is awesome. Um, bringing kind of Latin culture to country music. And I feel like this is like a great way to kind of open that door for me. And, you know, Jimencio is a very great mentor with all of that. Thank you. Now, do you want to do a little teaser, a little uh, duet, live duet, acapella right now for me? 
Si una vez dije que te amaba, hoy me arrepiento. Que si una vez dije que te amaba, no sé lo. Que pensé estaba loca. Si, si una vez, vez dije que te amaba. Y que por ti la vida está fácil. Si una vez dije que te amaba, no vuelvo a seguir. Ser amor es cosa de querer. Te di todo mi amor y más Y tú No reconoces ni lo que es amar Me puse dispuesta a tus pies Y tan solo con despecho me has pagado Pero ahora de ir una vez dije que te amaba 